something new at the beach and Gulf Shores, parking meters. Now, before, beachgoers would have to stop at a parking booth and pay, but that caused a lot of traffic backups. Not anymore. Fox 10 News reporter Hubert Tate has the story. Hello, parking meters. Goodbye, parking cashiers. This is good all day today. City leaders in Gulf Shores installed these solar-powered parking meters to relieve traffic that often backs up on Highway 59. There are signs posted advising beachgoers about the changes. We'll have parking attendants here to be able to help. Uh, they'll also be here to make sure that people pay for parking. We'll be starting to issue citations uh, on behalf of uh, or if people if people don't pay for their parking. Don't pay? That's a $15 fine. Here is how the process works. Once you have parked your car, look for the number on the ground. It's going to be very important that you remember that number because you're going to have to put it into this machine. Once you've done that, you can either pay a dollar for one hour or five dollars for 12 hours. It's got a way of the future. It's easy to use. You just... Tanya Cosette likes the new technology, but... Sometimes it's better just to deal with the person. You know, not just a machine all the time. Sometimes you want to deal with a person. One more thing. The machines take credit or cash, but they don't give change. So make sure you have the exact amount. In Gulf Shores, Hubert Tate, Fox 10 News.